Hey there, Groovy Stribbling people, I'm Kanjun Dave, and today I would like to talk to you about something that lurks deep beneath the ocean. It's scary, and it's freaky, and it kind of, they go schlumpity schlumpity schlump like that. That's right, we're talking about sea monsters. Freaky sea monsters! So come on up here, grab a pencil, get some paper, come with me, and I'm going to show you exactly how to create a cool cartoon sea monster. So starting over here, I'm going to kick off like I usually like to, with some cartoon eyes. And I'm going to start with circles with dots inside. Wow, circles and dots, it's crazy stuff. But from there, we're going to draw a mouth for this guy. His mouth is going to be a scoopy kind of U smiley shape. So maybe just something like this, and you can try that on your page. And from here, he's going to have a neck, and his neck is going to go a big long thing. It's going to plunge down into the water. There's a neck like that, and let's do another part down there like that too. So at the moment, he kind of looks like some sort of weird little sock puppet thing. But from here, he's going to have a back. And because he's a long, sort of snaky looking object, in a straight line along here, we're going to do an upside down U shape, like that. And then we're going to do another one that looks a little bit the same. Boop de doop, like that. And then maybe across here we'll do one more that just is kind of a half on it, just sort of poked up a bit like that. So this little guy, he's kind of squirting along, but we need more things to be happening here. We need him to look like he's in the water. So for this, let's just do maybe some slightly bendy line like that. Bit of line work like that. La la la, la la. And so it sort of now looks like he's going to be a little bit in the water. Let's add a couple more slightly wrinkly, watery looking lines around there too. So they're just kind of wobbly-ish, wibbly wobbly. But the thing that makes the difference is the line in the background. If we go a little bit higher here and then try and do a straight line that sort of goes like that and keeps on going kind of straight and hopefully this looks straight and not weird. <laughs> So see now, it kind of looks like he's in the water, which is very exciting. You can even add some bubbles like this if you want to, too. Little bubbles. But from here, we can also add some stuff to the sea monster himself. Maybe get some spiky things on top of his head. Raw, like this. And they can go all the way down his back. You can put a whole bunch of them on here, too, which looks kind of groovy. And I guess at this point, you just get to decorate him or her in any way you like. Look, some spiky things like that. Add some more little spiky things like that. I'm going to add some little circles up here, too and circles over here, and some bendy things so that it makes it look like he's moving a little bit through the water. And what we have there is a kind of a cool looking sea monster, but if you want to change his face, do you think you're allowed to? Of course, because with cartooning, there are no rules. So very quickly, I'm going to take this guy, and with my sock, I'm going to rub out his mouth area, and just change it ever so slightly by going, Rawr, and give this dude some chunky teeth like that. And I'm going to come around here and colour in this little part here, and I think maybe he's going to need some angrier eyes. So with my beautiful rubbing out sock, let's angry up this dude. Roar, like that. Give some angry eyes there. And it's still a sea monster. He still looks kind of groovy. Let's give him some horns too. And maybe some spiky things over here. Woohoo! Is he groovy? Is he cool? Is he scary? Is he scaring you to death? Possibly. But the cool thing is, he's a cartoon sea monster. Look at his little face. He's beautiful. So until next time, practice your sea monster, have another go at uh, something different. Maybe a beautiful girl sea monster. Maybe a sea monster with lovely flowing hair. Maybe just the letter C drawn as a monster. Whatever you like. Until next time, I'm Cartoon Dave. Keep scribbling and I'll see you next time.